Hi, it's Dr. Friedman, and today I want to talk about this uh, pad that we have going here. Here's my piece so far, so let's take a look at the, listen to the whole thing and see what's happening. Spinning the hottest beats in the New York tri-state area. area, area. It's your girl, DJ Freeds. One, two, three, four. Hip hop. Fuego, fuego, don't tell no one better. Rocking the hottest beat. Freeze. All right, so that's my work. I'm going to save it. Uh, so I was having a little trouble with this pad at first, and I had to go in here and figure out what was the problem. So if I looked at all of this, these are my chords that I had made previously, and I, you see I cranked the volume up, but sometimes you have this thing called velocity. V is velocity. This is what's called a MIDI parameter. It goes between 1 and 127, and my velocity was really, really, really low. So if you take a listen to what it sounds like when the velocity is really low, here it is. So I had some trouble, so I just selected all of these. I clicked on this V tool and I increased the velocity. In this particular instrument, the highest velocity of 127 doesn't distort the sound. It doesn't make it sound different than I want it to. And now I can control um, the volume and have more output just by putting this in. Four. Hip hop. So I can control all of that. The other thing that I had been talking about is if you have a problem with volume, let's say I crank this up and I still wanted more sound, you could double the track. Or we had talked about using possibly um, adding an effect and using this uh, volume knob, which is actually increasing the gain. I want you to hear what happens when I add some more volume here and just hit play on this track. Hip -hop. Yeah, that's distortion, that kind of <laughs> that stuff in the background. You don't want to have that added uh, by forcing volume. If you want to add distortion like on guitar tracks or even on vocal tracks or anything, you can do that. Uh, just go in here and use something called overdrive or um, sometimes these. there's a distortion pedal, sometimes fuzz. Uh, overdrive causes distortion. This is classic dist, which is distortion, classic distortion pedals. So some of these will give you those kinds of sounds and you can explore them. Adding those kinds of effects because you intentionally want to do that is a lot different uh, than adding distortion by forcing the volume. So use your compressors and use your distortion wisely and don't overload your tracks.